Hi everyone, welcome to today's video. If you like videos about food, fitness, or weight loss, go ahead and hit that subscribe button because I post at least once a week. I'm starting a new series right now called Try It Tuesday. So I'll be trying new things, new foods, new recipes, new workouts, so that you can have an idea about something maybe interesting, new, weird, like today's. Today I'm going to be trying a bulletproof coffee with egg in it. Now, I was watching YouTube and Nicole Burgess had a carnivore full day of eating vlog and she put an egg in her coffee. And I was like, what you doing girl? But then it was so foamy, like this much foam in the cup. And I was like, hmm, I do like a foamy coffee. So I looked it up and apparently like there's a Vietnamese coffee that has a really thick foam on it with egg. And I'm pretty sure that's how they do the cold foams too, is with egg. So I was like, you know what? Let's give it a try. So for today's first Try It Tuesday, we're gonna be making egg coffee. For my egg coffee, I will need a blender, ghee or clarified butter, heavy cream, collagen, and of course, an egg. You can put anything you want in your bulletproof coffee. I'm going with the collagen because I want some protein. I'm trying some ghee for some different flavor than regular butter, and I really like cream in my coffee. So you can choose to do MCT oil, you can choose to do butter, you can choose to do whatever random things you want in your bulletproof coffee. You will notice I'm not using any sweetener though. I am trying to kind of back off from any sweet stuff. So not just sugar, but artificial sweeteners too. So. Let's get started. I'm going to start with about a tablespoon of cream. Next, I'm also going to do about a tablespoon of ghee. For the collagen, the serving size is two scoops, and I feel like I might need some extra protein today, so I'll do two. Next, I'm gonna add the egg. I went ahead and did a pasture raised egg and you can tell how good it is based on that really orange yolk. All right, now I'm just gonna add coffee and blend. Well, I already recorded this and accidentally deleted it, but the blender was half foam and half coffee. So when I drink it, I'm pretty much just drinking foam. It's not sweet at all. It does have a good flavor from the ghee. Um, it would be really good with like some sweetener, maybe even some cinnamon. I picked out this mug because a student gave it to me. It says no drama for this llama. It was one of the biggest ones that I had and I knew I was gonna need it because you know, half of the blender was foam but I would definitely try this again, and I challenge you to try it out. So please comment below and let me know how your egg coffee turned out. Also go ahead and leave a comment if you have a suggestion for something I should try out. I'm pretty much open to anything. Um, I don't really eat like seafood, so that's probably off the table, but go ahead and give me suggestions below. Thank you so much for watching. I'll see you next time. Bye.